updated video of my homemade electric and pedal assisted bike. Main difference as you see here, if you've seen the old video, is the new 350 watt motor. Uh, still works at the top with a simple on and off switch. Um, and the gearing still remains the same as the old one, so you've got approximately 6 to 7 to 1 ratio in this top set of gears, and the bottom set of gears is 8, uh, sorry, 9 or 10 to 1, roughly. Not sure exactly, I can't quite remember my uh, measurements. Um, you ride it like you would an ordinary bike because the motor, as you can see, is geared to the pedals, so the pedals turn around about just over 80 RPM. The motor still has about the same um, RPM as the old motor, so they still turn about the same. It's 24 volt motor, it's rated at 19 amps, 350 watts. Um, the batteries, uh, the lead acid, still the same batteries, lead acid, two 12 volt, 18 amp hour batteries. Now, performance is a lot better than the old one, obviously because you've got the your new motor. But the, one, the one problem is that now it'll only do about 16 miles instead of 28 miles it used to do before you notice a drop in power. But the last couple of miles now on the route um, to and from work, the last couple of miles you can notice a, the batteries are beginning to get a little bit flat. So you have to work a little bit harder. Um, I'll go and pop the batteries in for one moment. And that just leaves me to take for a little test run along the road so you can see what it goes like. 